I'm Olivia. And I'm Wyatt. Today's December 5th, 2022. And it's a B-Day. Get in the winter holiday spirit this week. Tuesday, wrap yourself in love and positivity by wearing a positive t-shirt. Wednesday, wear your wackiest winter socks. Thursday, it's never too late to celebrate summer. Combine summer and winter clothes for Swinter. Friday, feeling frosty, dress like a snowman. Get ready for a night of improv with Lafayette's High School's award-winning improv team, Undefined. Performances will be December 9th at 3.45 for $3 and at 7 p.m. for $5. Also this week, Marquette's fall musical Pippin will run December 8th, 9th, and 10th. Pippin is the fictional story of Charlemagne's son Pippin, as it is told to the audience by a mysterious performing troupe and their leading player. It is a fun musical with a lot of Crestview alum on stage and behind the scenes. Check it out. Miss Montana's 7th and 8th grade theater workshop classes will be going to see Pippin at Marquette High School for a preview performance on Wednesday, December 7th. Permission slips need to be completed through the Google form before Wednesday. This field trip is optional and students are required to talk to their teachers about missed work before the trip. Bring a small snack. Meet in the main lobby Wednesday morning at the start of first hour. If you miss the bus, you will be left behind. The choir concert will be Tuesday, December 6th at 7 p.m. in the Crestview Middle School Gym. Come support your choir classmates and hear some beautiful music. Honor Choir, Rock and Strings, and Jazz Band will be traveling to Ellisville, Wild Horse, Westridge, and Kersmill Elementaries on December 9th to perform. Students attending the field trip need to talk to their teacher about missed work before the trip. Wear your music t-shirt and pants. Students can bring a bag lunch from home or bring $10 to buy their lunch. Good luck! Auditions for the Spring Musical will be live and in person on December 13th from 2.45 to 4.45 p.m. Callbacks will be December 15th during after-school activity period. Students interested in auditioning must complete the audition form on Ms. Fontana's website by December 12th. You can find the link to Mrs. Fontana's website in the description below. We need singers and non-singers, dancers and non-dancers. But we definitely need actors. Today is the last day to make your reservation for the Lafayette Madrigal Dinner. Lafayette will host a dinner on Thursday, December 15th at 6 p.m. with performances by choir and orchestra and Friday, December 16th at 6 p.m. with performances by choir and band. There will be a full three-course dinner served by Wildwood Pub and Grill. If you have, if you have questions, email Ms. Schaefer or find the direct link in the description below. And now, let's find out what classes are offered in theater for our 7th and 8th graders next year. 6th and 7th graders, are you thinking about what classes to take for your electives next year? You should think about taking Theater Workshop or Theater Studio. Both classes are full of fun projects for performing and behind the scenes. Theater Workshop is a transitional theater class that will give you a chance to learn a lot about theater and film in different ways. It is offered in 7th and 8th grade year for a semester and you can take it both years because your projects will fit your ability level. Students in Theater Workshop make a video announcements, perform puppet shows for the elementary schools, do improv, technical design, and so much more. Theater Studio is an advanced theater class that is only offered in the spring of 8th grade. Students taking Theater Studio should have already taken Theater Workshop or got permission from Mrs. Fontana. This class will get you ready for filmmaking and theater in high school and beyond. We will make a short film as a class and you will have the chance to perform in Little Thinkers Theater with Rockwood High School students. Student leadership opportunities include student directing, stage management, and playwriting. Um, because you can like hang out with your friends and do like fun activities. What's your favorite part about theater and why? My favorite part about theater is hanging out with all of my friends because it's really fun and we get to play with weird puppets. <laughs> <laughs> um, my favorite thing about theater is how included you feel in the class and it really feels like everyone gets a chance to say something, to share their thoughts. Yeah. Everyone can find something they love to in theater class, so give it a try. One, five, six minor, four. My life is brilliant, my life is pure. I saw an angel, of that I'm sure. People killing, people dying, children hurting.
Between now and December 20th, the library is accepting new and gently used books for patients of Cardinal Glennon Children's Hospital, who may be spending the holidays in the hospital. Students don't have to donate a book to make a difference. The library has gift tags for students to write a book recommendation, and the library will purchase a copy of that book to donate. So stop by the library and fill out your recommendation. I'm Wyatt. And I'm Olivia. There are only 13 school days left until winter break. Have, Have a, a great, great week. This has been a Crestview Curtain Call production. Made at Crestview. Woo-hoo.